Hey guys, uh, welcome back to Hermitcraft FTP Infinity. <laughs> Aw, yeah. Uh, so this guy here, uh, as you can see, is at 230 billion. So slow. <laughs> so slow. Uh, there's been a lot of comments about potion generators and this and that. And I I'm just trying to do things my own way. Like just, you know, having fun mess messing with the different kinds of power and all of that stuff so just you know bear with me sure i know there's much quicker ways to do this i'm just i'm, I'm having fun just playing so i'm just messing around with different stuff i know it gets expensive but i'm, I'm not poor <laughs> like i have stuff to mess with um so yeah <laughs> all right so last time we made uh, the the inversion inverted sigil pseudo inversion sigil thing uh, and this is why i made it right here that's it. That's all. Yep, just a super built. No, <laughs> I made it to make this right there. I believe this guy does two hundred and fifty-six thousand RF per tick. I think. I think. I could be wrong. There's there's actually a really good chance <laughs> I'm wrong. Uh, but that just means we'll have to come over here and actually look. In oh, actually, you know what? Let us nether another star. Then y'all, all right, and that's that's sixty four nether stars to make this guy. So this says ninety six million at forty thousand, uh, but I'm pretty sure that if we do that, it's two hundred and fifty six thousand. <laughs> that's what I thought. That's what I thought. All right, was that actually keeping? God, I want to. Oh, stop it. Okay, so yeah. <laughs> I wanted to look at this thing and see how fast it was going. All right, hold on. Let's do that. That'll find its way. Wow, look at that. Look at it go. You go. Uh, but that means even using something like that, and I can make more of those. That's like that's not a problem. I can make so many of those. Um, the problem comes in with the nether stars. Uh, we have... Uh-oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, um, okay, <laughs> um, uh-oh, is that me, or is that Slip doing something funky? Is he, like, using the builder or something? Is that, let's see, C-O-F-H, T-P-S, uh, we're world 13, I don't see anything standing out, all right, maybe it was probably just a little bit of lag. Uh, so yeah, we've got like 3,000 diamonds, or two, well, <laughs> 2,300 diamonds. Um, but like, and I, I've already broke down a bunch of this, but we got like 142 nether diamonds, and that's two diamonds each if you just smelt it, and then 323 diamond ore. So we've got diamonds, we've got iron, and that's all you need to make the unstable ingots. So that part of it's not a problem. The rest of it's just redstone, stone, iron all that kind of junk so yeah uh, but in the in the spirit of um possibly automating the wither farm <laughs> we have this guy this guy right here in my hand <laughs> uh, so i had to go get a whole bunch of wither skulls uh, to make that that generator wow did it chew through those already holy crap <laughs> it chews through that so fast Wow, and they didn't make a dent. Uh, we need something like that running all the time. Uh, so we need to get this guy going. Uh, we don't have any more spawners, actually. Uh, so I gotta go... I guess I gotta go find some spawners, yeah? And then make a place for this. Uh, maybe use some diamond gears on it, or some diamond spikes. Or... Hmm. Because you can, like, the Killer Joe, you can give it a sword with looting. Uh, but you need the heads. And, like, looting increases the head drop. But it would be really nice if we could use uh, something like this. Uh, this cleaver. 
which it has a 90% like and and you can get up, get it up to 100%. This is as upgraded as this one can get. So yeah. <laughs> uh but yeah, like it's like if we could use that in the Killer Joe, uh, I've already tried, you can't do it. Uh, but if we could use that, that would be amazing cuz you you're pretty much guaranteed a head, like a skull from every kill. And unlike, you know, putting a skeleton spawner in the nether, this is a guaranteed wither skeleton, not just a skeleton, you know. Yeah. All right, so I'm going to go find some spawners. I actually need some draconic cores. And I think I'm going to go to the twilight. I think that's about the best place to find them. A draconic core. There it is. Right, let's make... We'll go with six. I'm probably not going to need them, but whatever. All right, so yeah, I'm going to go find some uh, some more spawners, uh, get us wither skeleton spawner set up. Um, and then maybe look at, uh, like, wait, why am I going to spawn? <laughs> uh, maybe look at auto meeting the wither killer, uh, at least when I'm on. Uh, when I log off, then I want it to shut off. But yeah, I'll be back. Alrighty, uh, so I've got this guy pretty much, uh, well, he's built, <laughs> I guess you could say. Um, the spawner's in there, it's all souped up and ready to go. Uh, I have six extra spawners, so we should be good for a bit. Uh, I did change the Enderman spawner. Like, I don't know that I showed you guys all this. I think I did all this, like, well, this I just did, like, dropping it down like this, but I have grinders here. I don't think I showed that. But I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, but yeah, I've got a couple grinders here. They're just going into there, and everything is uh, everything is good. Everything is good. Uh, I'm gonna do something kind of similar over here uh, for the for the for the skeleton guys. Uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drop a mana glass if it would let me place it. Ding. Oh. Bing. No, no, <laughs> what? The? I don't know why it does that, but it's very, very annoying. Uh, yeah, that should be good enough. All right, yeah, these guys shouldn't be alive for too long. <laughs> uh, well, I'm, well, I guess I could. We, we're gonna need that anyway. Uh, but we're gonna go like this, and then we're gonna grab our trusty old super build. Whoa! <laughs> we make sure we don't click on that. Holy crap! And yeah, we're gonna come down right there and then we're going to uh, bring these out like so and then, oh uh yeah that should be good enough yeah all right so now we need to get up inside there so let's drop in from the top uh-oh eh, uh. <laughs> uh all right so we're gonna have to get rid of this for the time being all right so right here 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 and here, uh, we're gonna have something that I don't have on me because you know I, I plan like that. <laughs> so we're gonna need these to come out actually one more for now. All right, let's go up here. Let's grab all of this. <laughs> yeah, you see what I'm going for here. You see what I'm going for here. All right, let's see. Autonomous activator. Activator, activator, activator. This guy should be on punch. No. You gonna punch? Thank you. <laughs> hey, be nice. Punch. Uh, we want first slot only. Thank you. Thank you. And... Oh, I didn't put you on punch. 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 Yup. Yeah. Uh-huh. We're good? Nice. Uh... <laughs> I, I love it when I when I plan ahead. I love it. Love it. Okay. Boom, boom, boom. There we go. Alright, so this is set up in such a way that, you know, like, it. I'm trying to split them between the different sides. This here is to keep them from just sitting in the middle uh, so that they uh, die and stuff. Yeah. You know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying. Alright, let's get rid of this. And this. And this. And this. Alright, so we're going to need a transfer node, because that's how we'd be picking up the items. So that's there, that's good. 
Uh, and then uh, we're going to need power. So I think what I might do is just slap a Tesseract right there. And then we'll just run power from that. Ooh, we're going to need experience too. <gasps> oh no. Aha! Experience. We'll just put a, a vacuum hopper right there with stuff in it so it doesn't... Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, I planned ahead. I planned ahead. <laughs> no, I didn't. Okay. Uh, what am I? What am I? What am I? What am I? What am I looking... Oh, all right. So we'll just wrap this around this way. You can come over here. Come around. Very good. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. And thank y'all. We don't need it to go all the way around, but we're going to go around all, all the way around anyway, because we can. Uh, yeah, because these guys require power now. <laughs> so, all right, so we can toss that in there. That in there. That in there. And these guys, they're basically like mine, uh, except they're made out of manulin. And they've got Beheading 7 on it and Flux. And that's it. Like, that's the only things they have on it. Um, and then, oh, like, I, I, I haven't char, uh, or I haven't tried charging these with a wireless charger in the autonomous activator, but I'm thinking it should work. All right. So if we come up here, oh, no, let's, let's set the Tesseract to send stuff. Actually, no, Tesseract isn't sending anything <laughs> except experience, uh, but we, you know, we can test it. We can test it. All right. Let's go down here. Turn that on. Shouldn't take them long to spawn. And we should be able to see them die. Dead, 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 and dead. Very nice, very nice, very nice, very nice. Oh, let's turn it off. <laughs> let's turn it off. Yeah, they're not staying alive for very long, which is good. That's what we want. Uh, but we do need another vacuum hopper for the experience, and, and we need to sort all of this crap. And then we're gonna we're gonna make sure this guy goes really fast because they drop more than just the one thing. Uh, so we're gonna want them to uh, drop, or we're gonna want this thing to pick up all the stuff. And then for now, no. For now, we're just going to do this. And then what's in you? <laughs> What's in you? Bones? Nothing. Go there. Nothing. There. Alright, so that should be, let's see, we got bones, skulls, necrotic bones. There we go. And then I guess, uh, this is going to be really ugly, now that I think about it. Um, everything that doesn't get sorted is going to come over uh, here. <laughs> oh crap. Um, uh, let's get rid of this. Yeah, there we go. All right, and then we'll just come. Whatever. It's gonna. It's gonna be ugly. That's that's all there is to it. Oh, place. Thank you. All right, there we go. So items send. Fluid send, energy receive, and that should be good. That is on spawners, right? Yes. And that should be good to go. So everything should get uh, sorted, except uh, let's go home. We need to grab another vacuum hopper, which I should have. Uh, I should have at least one, oh, uh, at least one more made. Let's see. Oh back. Aha! Very nice. It's like I planned. <laughs> I actually didn't. I just made too many one time. And now I have them for other times. Alright. Let's get this vacuum hopper down here. Boop. And we'll just stick this in there. And then we'll go O. Flip this. Go down. Nice. And we should be good to go. These guys shouldn't pick up anything. Right? Right. Oh, you know what else? I, you know what I want to try? Let's grab this guy. Oh, he's he's going to hit us. 
That guy's very violent. Aha. Uh -huh. Alright, so let's see if this charges the things. Let's put it there. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. It doesn't. Oh, that sucks. That sucks. That sucks. That sucks. Uh, so I'll have to get a filter system for that. Um, dang, that really sucks. Uh, but you know what? It, like, it takes forever for that for those things to run out. Oh, and that went in the storage system. Nice. Um, <laughs> dang it! Dang it! Things just they don't want to work. Whatever. All right, so it should be it should be good to go anyway. Uh, and we should get lots and lots and lots of skulls, because each thing has a 90% chance to <coughs> uh, drop a skull. So, yeah. <laughs> Alright, so let's look. Let's watch it for a second. 24, 27, 28. Ah, nice. And then bones, necrotic bones. Yeah, look at that. Toss that in there. Toss that in there. And coal's just going to go back to uh, the ME system where there's already a deep storage unit for coal. Nice. I like it. And these skulls are eventually going to go over there. Yeah. <laughs> it's going to be... Uh, you set your... Are you trying to come to me? Is that what your problem is? Why is... why you know... Is it pulling experience? I can't tell. No, it's... What is your problem? <laughs> no, it is. Okay, it is pulling ex... okay. Yeah, it's pulling experience. And... Yeah, look at that. So many skulls. <laughs> Very nice. All right, guys. Uh, so I'm gonna I'm gonna watch this for a bit. I'm gonna make some tweaks and all of that stuff, and I'll be back. All right, guys. So just real quick, uh, I wanted a way to monitor uh, the levels that these swords are at. As you can see, they're getting kind of low. I haven't really devised a way to uh, like pull them out. Like I, I well, I mean, I know I can. I'm just I haven't done it. <laughs> uh, but I want to be able to monitor. Uh, where they are, and so what I th oh, no. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try these. And like I don't think they're gonna work this far away because the base is like 500 blocks that way. But I guess we'll find out. <laughs> like because it, it it monitors an inventory and then shows you whatever's in that inventory, and I do believe as the swords get used, it will actually update. I think. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> I don't, okay. Let's put that one in there. Alright, so let's try inventory slot one. No. <laughs> inventory slot two. No. Oh, it's is it one of those zero? Zero. Aha! Zero. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Uh, zero. Uh-oh. Is that one out of range? <laughs> um. Hmm. Is that one out of Like, really? Huh. What's going... Zero... Is that slot one? What's going... Uh, two, three, four? No? <laughs> Uh, zero. No. Oh, that's odd. Monitor. Oh, wait. Which one was the one that worked? All right. That's the one that works. These don't work for some reason. All right, which one? All right. I've set that one. Let's try this one. Zero. Hmm. Do I have too many things? Like, because I don't need that or that. Is it because I have too many things on here? No. That's really weird. Like, why isn't... Like, why is only the one... working? 
Hmm. <laughs> and where did that one go? Where, where? I'm missing one, right? What is this one? Oh, no, that, wait, what? All right, so that is work. Oh, did you see that? Oh, no, that's working there. Um, <gasps> oh, I see why. <laughs> oh, I see. <clears throat> it's because that one's a plus. And these ones are not. Uh, plus. Oh, wait. Inventory. Inventory module. Where's the inventory plus? That's inventory plus. <laughs> Hold on. Recipe. All right. Aha! That's how we do. Now they should work. Alright. Let's see. Aha! Uh-oh. Why you know... Oh, it's not gonna show. Oh, you know what? I don't need those in there anymore. So I think we just ran out of screen. Or not. Why you know work? <laughs> Still only that one that's not working. Is it just going to show the three? Is that what it is? Let me take that out of there. Aha! There we go. Um, it'd be nice if like I could have them like going that way, but I don't think there's a way to do that. Hmm. Sucks. That really sucks. But we can monitor them, so like we can see how they're doing. They all should be about the same. I think this is the one that's on that side. Because most of the guys end up on that side for some... I think it's that side. Yeah, it's that side. Yeah, most of the guys end up on that side for some reason. But it is working. It is working. So we can keep an eye on it so we know when to charge. Uh, which I should probably do pretty soon. But I think all I'm really going to do is just stick a wireless charger here. And then just like grab the swords into my inventory. And then just let it charge real quick and then be done with it or something. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, I just want to show you that real quick. I'll be back. All right. Um, so in the, in the process of somewhat automating this thing, uh, I switched it over to this insulated redstone uh, conduit. Uh, just so that I could put uh, item conduit in the same place. And for some reason, without a one tick delay across the ones that do the skulls, uh, the wither doesn't spawn. Yeah, I'm not really sure. Like, it was working fine with just the red alloy wire. But with this, apparently, I need um, a repeater. <laughs> and it's set to one tick. That's it. Just one tick. And it should work. And so this is going to be the chest uh, that comes from uh, down here. And now what we're going to have to do is somehow figure... Yeah, look at that. 3,800. Uh, we're going to have to somehow figure out uh, how we're going to keep those items in here. <laughs> uh, I didn't think about that. Um... Because you can't filter this right here. Like, it, it's just not possible. You can't do it. Uh, so I'm thinking what I might have to do is put in a chest and then filter it. Because, like, these guys you can filter, like, wherever you want. Uh, these guys, you can't. You can only filter it there. Well, I mean, I, I guess I could put a retrieval node here. I may do that. I'll probably put a retrieval node and uh, filter it for... Yeah, <laughs> you see what I'm saying. Alright, so we're going to stick this guy right here. And we're going to have him go insert and extract. And he should be doing things. And then let's go ahead and toss just some of those in there. There he goes. He's doing stuff. And that's going to really screw up, isn't it? Uh, Alright, so that's good enough for now. We're just, we're just, we're, we're testing. Alright, there we go. And then this guy up here, 
let's see, insert, 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 extract with no power. Uh, let's see, round robin enabled. Boom. And we should be seeing 47, 47, 51, 55. <laughs> All right, so let's put, oh, no, let's drop some of those in there just because, you know, it's taken for freaking ever. Um, still taking forever, but whatever <laughs> whatever yeah there we go all right so that's pretty much it for this and uh, we got to figure out some way of getting like either either we're gonna quarry the nether and just get like a little like an absolute crap ton of soul sand or we're gonna have to figure out a way to do it and i think really the only way to make soul sand is with the sludge boiler which yeah i'm not sure i want to do that i, I don't know We'll figure it out, I, I guess. <laughs> we'll figure it out. Um, but yeah, there you go. There you go. Everything's, everything's, uh, everything's starting to work, I think. Maybe. Uh, and like I say, I'll get a retrieval note on this guy to filter it out and all of that. But yeah, that's going to do it for today. <laughs> uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed the episode. And I will see you all next time.